friends welcome back to my channel today's video is kind of a hodgepodge haul of things i've picked up throughout like the week or two so i'm just gonna oh lord sir sir so this haul will include bath and body works there is victoria's secret there is a little miscellaneous from ulta and there is tree hut so yeah, if you guys are interested, stay tuned. Let me go ahead and quickly get into this video. First one, I'll go ahead and do Bath & Body Works. I did my first ever even exchange with Bath & Body Works. I was pretty nervous, but it was easy, it was simple, and it made me realize there's no reason to be nervous. So I took in four body sprays, I believe, and one lotion, and that's what I got back. I wanna show you what I picked up instead. First one up is Gingham Love. I was so excited to try this one. I love all ginghams. I love, love, love all ginghams. And the fact that this is love, like Valentine's Day, hearts, my vibe, my aesthetic, I absolutely love. I know a lot of people don't like Valentine's Day for like love purposes and whatever. I actually love Valentine's Day because everything is hearts, everything is love, everything is glitter and pink and red and teddy bears. Like, I just love, love, I love Valentine's Day. So to me, this was, an, of course I had to pick this up because it's gingham and because it's gingham love. So let me go ahead and do a quick smell test. Ooh, that is, oh, it's like, it's the classic gingham with the twist. What is it? It's, it's a sweetness in there. It's like a berry. What is that? Hold on. Oh, sugared red berries, blushing freesia and rose meringue. So it's basically gingham floral with a mix of berries. It's sweet, it's floral, it's a nice balance, it's flirty. Oh, I love this one. So the one that came out for semi-annual cell or whatever, the Gingham Hearts in the gold packaging, that one has apples in it, this one has berries in it. So you can definitely smell the berries in this one. I think this one is juicier and the Gingham Heart one is maybe, um, maybe sweeter? I'm not entirely sure, but this one is definitely, you can smell the juicy berries with the Gingham. Oh, that's delicious. I love it. Um, in my eyes, they can't go wrong with gingham so far. So to me, I'm going to give this a thumbs up. That's if you like the gingham scents. The next one up, I got Peach Prosecco Macaron. Macaroon. Macaron. I'm not entirely sure. I said it all three ways just in case. But let me go ahead and see this one. So for the first time, I did actually smell them in store. So these are the ones I actually like to pick up. How I, I didn't, unfortunately, did not like the... What is it? The peach praline. Oh, that one's good. I did not. <coughs> sorry, it's, I did too much. I didn't like that uh, praline one. I thought I would. The notes in him sounded fantastic. It sounded delicious, but I didn't like it. It's a very hit or miss. I've noticed that either you love it or you hate it. That one you definitely cannot buy blind. You should smell it before you buy it. But so let me see. Oh, this is so just sweet and flirty. I love this one. So it's Peach Prosecco, so it does have like that bubbly Prosecco alcoholic beverage type of hint in there. Vanilla cream and macaron cookie. It's just, it's really sweet. It's bubbly. It's flirty. It's it's kind of airy. It's not like a sexy like perfume smell. It's, it's more airy and bubbly. Oh, and you can definitely, definitely smell the cookie, the peach, the Prosecco. You can smell all the notes in it, or I can. I love it, Owen. This is actually where I wore, what I wore today. This is the one. And I put some gingham on top. I did actually pick up two ginghams because um, I mentioned I took four. So I had to get four back. And none of the other scents really caught my eye besides gingham. So now since I have a backup, I could go crazy spraying one of them and not feel bad. And then the last one I picked up is the Whipped Berry Meringue. Now I know this is a dupe for the Cotton Candy Skies and the Beach... No, Laffy, some, you know what I'm talking about. It's like the other one. So this is a repackaging. They say, I'm not sure, I haven't compared the two. It's just good. It's just good. It's sweet. If you have a sweet tooth, again, this is the line. I think, what is this? Was this like the bakery collection or something? I'm not entirely sure, but it's sweet. It's fresh berries, whoop sugar, fluffy vanilla. You could definitely smell the fluffy vanilla. It's... Yeah, again, it's a it's a sweet tooth type of gourmand, so it's not like a bakery gourmand where it smells like cookies or anything. It's more of a sugary sweet. Definitely smell the berries, the sugar, the vanilla. It's just really good. I did like whipped berry meringue. And the last one in here is, oh, I picked up the body lotion for peach prosecco also. And that is it for the Death and Fireworks. A very small haul. 
again i'm trying to do my best with not over purchasing anymore i have a huge collection i'm in the process of moving half my collection over to the new apartment with me and my boyfriend and i don't want to take this whole thing with me so i'm trying to like buy stuff i know i'm gonna love or do even exchanges so it is next one i'm gonna show is victoria's secret so victoria's secret did pick up uh like underwears uh pants shorts i got a free blanket because it came in the promotion so there are clothing i picked up but i'm just going to show you guys the body care and the two candles because i've never tried victoria's secret candles before and i got this on the semi-annual and i'll let you know how it is the first one up i did get the fine fragrance mist and the perfume of just a kiss so it looks like this super cute and it's delicious i love it let's see if i can try um, I threw the packaging uh, in my last video, the perfume collection organizing one. The packaging and all that was in there so you could see what it looks like. It just, so it's a sweet floral. It's perfume, so it's strong, it's concentrated. It's, to me, it's very girly, it's playful, it's sexy, it's, I don't know, I really like it. It's called Just a Kiss. And then of course the fine fragrance mist. It's not as strong, however, it's still, you know, Oh shoot, I hope my dog doesn't... He chose to be the fine fragrance mist. Again, smells the same, just a little bit more... Not watered down, but not as strong because it's not concentrated, but it's delicious. I love it. Um, that's the one. I also picked up Sweet Fig. So this is Purple Fig and Vanilla Honey. Ooh, their sprayers are very... Boom. I like it. I didn't know if I would like this or not, but I do. It smells like honey smells like the sweetness from the fig I don't know it's just overall really good it's vanilla honey so you do pick up a hint of vanilla it's just good I really like this one I didn't know how I feel about fig but I do really like this one so if it's on sale and you see it go ahead and pick it up because it does smell pretty good I have two of these cocoa vanillas because I see you can see this one look at this one do you see a difference so this one came with the nozzle broken so I hit them up and I was like, hey, um, it's broken. And so they sent me a new replacement. If you could look here, it's supposed to be right there. So this is, you know, it's supposed to be a pump. So you could get the lotion out, but I can't. So I'm going to have to manually open it every time, which is not a problem. But again, if I paid for it and it's broken, you know, I'm going to ask for a replacement or something because this is a hassle. But it's, oh, it smells so if you like vanilla this is it if you like vanilla this cocoa vanilla is delicious i fell in love with this so i have two of these now the cocoa vanillas and i also purchased the body scrub i love love uh pink scrubs i don't think they're talked about enough but they are so good they are pretty abrasive they're not like the dove ones they're these are pretty abrasive and i love it and it smells so good like it smells so 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 good again if you like vanilla scents try this one out i think it smells pretty authentic to vanilla it has a sweetness to it like not like a sugary sweet or anything it's just like a natural sweetness to it i don't know maybe it's the cocoa part but it smells a little by the way his name's coco um but he's deaf that's why every time i say he doesn't catch it but so i had to pick these up during their semi-annual sale now this is what i've been waiting for the two candles i've never tried victoria's secret candles if you have let me know in the comments below i do feel they're pretty overpriced so that's why i waited to the sale to pick this up i was actually looking for the price and it's not on here first one i picked up is an illuminite is this all the same thing oh yeah illuminite it says scent notes are arctic air crystal woods and silent nights I kind of hate when they use descriptions like that so because what the hell does a silent night smell like you let me know in the comments down below because i don't know what a silent night smells like so i am curious to try their candles it's nothing i want to collect it's nothing i want to really use because i have so many and their prices is, are just absurd absurd but i did want to pick this up so it looks like ooh. so it's like this glass oh I don't know so hmm. it, it smells outdoor it's a fresh scent you can smell like a woods oh it says crystal woods 
this is this looks tiny it's heavy but it's tiny so it's eight ounces eight well i haven't burned it obviously uh scent alone it smells like what it says it smells like uh i think this one you're kind of paying for the packaging so if you like what this looks like it's just a mirror i guess a mirror cup because it's pretty tiny it's 8.4 ounces you know you're paying for the packaging basically which this would be a cute like cup after you're done melting it so this is Illuminite. I'm curious to light that one though at nighttime with the mirror effect. I feel like that would be cute. So let me try the next one. The next one is Frostbite. This is Whip Berries, Glitter Balm, and Joy to the World. So whatever Joy to the World smells like, I have it. Off the bat, as soon as I open this, I can smell it. So this one I can smell just right off the packaging. Ooh, and this one is a purple mirror. I don't know if you can see that, but it is just mirror. It does have the notes right back there, but it's just a mirror cup. Mmm, it does smell good. It's very light. Um, again, so it says whip berries, glitter bomb, and joy to the world. I don't know what I'm supposed to take from that. I guess just berries. And it does kind of have a berry scent. It's very, very light. I could barely pick up anything. Hopefully when I light it, it does actually give off scent. But as far as... That's it. That's it. <laughs> it smells like berries. Not too strong. It's more like outdoor berries. Um, not too sweet. Not, not Nothing like out of the way. But yeah, like I mentioned, I only picked it up because it was on sale. I don't really have a need for these candles. I just wanted to see what they were like and I guess the containers are kind of cute so it works hand in hand. That is all for Victoria's Secret. Next one up I'm gonna go with Tree Hut. So y'all, uh, so y'all, Tree Hut surprised me. So they have sent me one PR box before and that was a couple months ago so I thought like they forgot about me. It was like a one-time thing. I showed up. This was at my door today. I had no idea. No emails. No nothing. I saw like my name down there. It says Erica. And I was like, what the hell? Well, it was upside down my door. So I was like, what the hell is that? And I turned it over and I saw Tree Hut and I screamed. They sent me another PR package, which amazing. So you guys, this is what I opened it to. It is, I don't know if these are new. I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming they're new. So this is Coconut Colada is in whipped shea body butter so again i don't know if these are new or not but i do have a couple of their body butters but not these scents look at that oh my goodness oh it's beautiful and uh it smells so good so it is pineapple and coconut yeah i mean you if you know what coconut if you know what cocoa colada smells like then yeah it smells just like that and now i have the whipped body butter Thank you so much to Tree Hut. This was such a beautiful surprise at my doorstep. I was not expecting this at all. The second one they sent is the Moroccan Rose one. It looks like this. And I do have the body scrub of this, so I'm excited to match them up together. It looks like that. Now that one has my little fingers running through it because I did try it out immediately. And that scent of rose and like it, it, it is floral but it has like a tang to it so it's not too strong in your face floral it does have a little sweetness touch to it it's a whipped body butter so it's so like soft and just whipped and ah oh, amazing i cannot wait to use these there is no note or anything else in here so beyond grateful that tree hut sent me another package because i was not expecting this at all so this one thank you so much tree hut for sending me this the next one is a quick haul I'll just show you guys. So I did pick up the Ariana Grande Cloud perfume and it looks like this. So it looks like this. You can take this out of the little cute packaging. I didn't know how I would feel about Ariana Grande perfumes because in my head she's another celebrity and I feel like celebrities don't put a lot of thought or care in their products really. But everyone on YouTube loves this so I decided to give it a try. and. I'm not disappointed. It smells pretty good. It smells pretty good. I don't think the notes are on here. Let me double check. Notes aren't on the bottle. You know what? They should definitely start adding notes on the bottle. But it's a fair, it's a sweet, like marshmallowy cloud type of sweet scent. If you like that kind of scent, it is really good. It, it's perfume, so it's strong, it's concentrated, 
it's good i really like this one i also sent a bottle over to my new place so i have i'll keep one here at this house and one at my house with my boyfriend so I'm, i have two of them so i really like the scent so i picked up this the last thing i picked up is another ogx coconut coffee sugar scrub i haven't used this in like maybe two years but the way everyone on youtube talks about this i had to pick it up again so i could see like am i missing out something because i don't remember if i like this or not i am not the biggest fan of coffee scents i don't even drink coffee um so i didn't know how i would feel about this but everyone loves it and they all say that even if you don't like coffee you'll like this so i do want to give it another shot as i got it from walmart I mean, to me right now, it smells like coffee grinds. I don't know how it's going to smell in the shower, but I'm excited for it. I hope I like it because everyone here loves this scent, so I'm excited to try it myself. And yeah, that was it. That was it for my little miscellaneous haul of body care products. Let me know if you guys have picked up anything new. I love hearing about what you guys pick up. I'm, I'm nosy too. I want to see what y'all pick up too. And we could talk in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.